Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Kayla Lachey and y'all already saw the title. I am so freaking excited. You don't even know. I have heard about this product coming out for way too long and every month I'm like, oh, is it coming out? Is it coming out? Every month I'm like, oh, when is it dropping? Baby, it is here. It first dropped in Australia and I thought it was launching everywhere at the same time, but it was on delay, but it is finally here. And available in the US so I'm gonna link you guys to everything in this video in the description box so here's the product right here you guys we got some new blessed protein vegan protein bars yes three different flavors we're gonna talk about that we're gonna talk about the calories we're gonna talk about what type of protein source this is we're gonna talk about the things that I like about it does it taste good what is the texture I'm a texture person okay and what is the consistency and all that kind of stuff so if you guys are interested stay tuned <laughs> So let me just talk about the packaging of these protein bars. I feel like Bless kills it with their packaging. It just looks very aesthetic. It makes me want to reach for it. If something is cute, then I like to actually reach for it because it makes me feel like... Sorry guys, my camera. It makes me feel like I need it in my life. So this flavor right here is probably one of the ones that I saw that I was the most excited about. And it is the Chalk Raspberry. So it's giving chocolate raspberry vibes. I always feel like that's such a top tier combo. And these say that it lasts until April 2024. So it's good for a whole year if you buy a box of these. And you're getting 12 protein bars per box. And from what I know is you have to buy it in a box, which is why I wanted to do this video to let you guys know what I really think about it and if it's worth it or not. Because I'm on a fitness journey, as you guys know from this channel, and protein is something that is super important for weight loss for maintaining your weight even gaining weight like you just need to focus on having a lot of protein in your diet so i always love things like this that i can grab and go and get a good bit of protein with in my snacks and my meals things that i could have post-workout that i don't have to mix in a shaker cup or anything like that and for the convenience of everything so this is what the packaging looks like ASMR the packaging is a 10 out of 10 for me for sure so let me just talk to you guys about like the details and everything so this specific flavor is hundred and seventy four calories and yes they are all vegan friendly and dairy free plant-based so I love that as someone that is dairy free it's made with non GMO ingredients they are also gluten free which is really nice as well I feel like they do a great job at catering towards different people's dietary needs and this one has i believe 10 grams of protein per bar i want to just double check yeah 10.5 grams of protein you guys so the source of the protein is coming from soy protein and then pea protein so i would like to that's interesting because i know that protein powder in the tubs is pea based it's soy free so i was kind of expecting these to also be soy free but they're not so i just wanted to point that out in this video so that's just the main specs i think the source of the protein is important if you guys are looking for a protein bar i know like one of my favorite protein bars is like the cliff brand and that also has soy in it and it has a texture to it so i'm interested to see if these have like a texture or is it going to be soft all the way through so i'm going to taste test that in a second this flavor is the other flavor that i am the most excited to try you guys will see for obvious reasons in a second and it is their salted caramel which i believe is one of their most popular protein flavors and i just love this packaging combo it's giving me like fall time vibes super cute this one is 180 calories for the bar also vegan friendly non-gmo gluten-free and this one is also made with the same protein blend of pea protein and soy protein oh this has soy protein nuggets is that a texture thing we're gonna have to see and obviously these are coated in chocolate 
which I think is going to be really delicious. I love chocolate, you guys. I'm also on my period, so you know, the chocolate cravings be hitting. So that's that flavor. And then the last flavor that is out right now in this range is the Chalk Peanut Caramel flavor. So I have a nut allergy, so I won't be able to taste test these for you guys in this video, but we'll see how the taste test goes, and I'll let you know if I would recommend it based on other things like the texture and the chocolate coating and all that kind of stuff. I guess ultimately it'll just depend on what flavors you like the best, will depend on which one that you will want to get. And this one has for the calories 179 calories per bar so they kind of are in the same range it just depends so let's get into this taste test i wanted to film a real post so be right back i literally grabbed this from outside so i think it got smushed um i feel like something tells me these will be really good if you stick them in the fridge but i haven't tried it i just opened it up and it's already like gooey and it's oozing, I hate that word, with the raspberry. So let's give it a taste. Smell check. It smells like chocolate. Mmm. Oh, there's a crunch to it. Mmm. It's like a layer of um, a cookie. Everything is coated in chocolate. And then you have like the raspberry. It's giving like a jam type of taste. The chocolate's really good. And I love that they did chocolate and it's vegan. And then all of this, like the protein, it is soft, but it's nice that it has the texture. Otherwise, I, I don't know if I could do it like it has a nice bit of texture from like the thick coated chocolate the gooey raspberry that little crunch from the cookie and then the softness of the protein but it doesn't taste like protein mm. it tastes like a candy bar literally mmm And I can't tell if there's bits of chocolate in the protein. It kind of looks like it, right? You see that? Sweet, but doesn't have like an artificial taste. These are amazing. I'm throwing these in my gym bag. I'm not gonna eat the whole thing because we're gonna taste the caramel. Wow. Next, I would already rate this five out of five star. For a protein, like, I'm used to eating the Cliff Bars, right? Those are dry. <laughs> this is not dry. If you like chocolate, go for this. Do yourself a favor, go for this. Salted caramel. I love sweet and salty foods. I'm a salty girly, so when I saw that they were doing salted caramel, baby. Sign me up. I'm gonna open this for my reels and then I'll be right back. Hopefully this one's not busted the house. Stand by. And we're back. So this one is nice and clean. You can see how pretty the way that the chocolate is kind of glazed over. It's definitely like a bite to it. So girl, I'm about to pop these in the fridge and then try them again tomorrow and see how that is. But my mouth is watering, it's so good. <laughs> so I feel like the chalk raspberry is gonna be hard to beat. Smells like a candy bar. Oh, this one doesn't have like that filling, like the, you know? Still has a crunch to it, which I appreciate. It's like a light crunch. Ooh. Ooh. This tastes like dessert. There is caramel. Shut the front door. I just had to get to it. I was not expecting that. 
I thought it was just the flavor of the, wow, okay, five out of five. Mm-hmm, this should be illegal. How good this is. <laughs> what the actual heck? And I'm not just saying that, I've tried a lot of protein bars, and a lot of them I just couldn't do it because I'm a texture person. And protein, let's be honest, is hard to get right, especially a vegan plant-based protein because it's not, it doesn't have that dairy in it, which I feel like can add to the flavor and the consistency changes. But this is really tasty. The only thing, like for me personally, I wish it was soy-free, but you can't win them all. Like even Cliff, like I said, has the soy and I still like those a lot, but the taste, the consistency, the aesthetic, the price is really good for 12 bars per pack. The flavor choices that you have. So if I had to pick between um, the salted, salted, salted caramel and then the chalk raspberry, I don't know if I could choose. I don't know. I think I really, I really like the chocolate raspberry. I just like that combo so much. It's giving luxury, like, I don't know, like, bougie, I don't know, vibes. So, this is just really convenient for me. And I'm a lazy fitness girly, as you guys know. So, if I can get 10 grams of protein and something that tastes like candy, sign me up. Sign me up, shorty. So, I will link you guys below so you guys can shop EHP Labs and get yourselves some of these new protein bars. And you guys can save with my code. K10 at checkout as always and again I can't try the other flavor but my mom's gonna be home from work when I get back from the gym so I'm gonna have her taste it for you guys and she was super excited to hear that I was getting these in so I can't wait to hear her review as someone that's not in the fitness space and someone that is not dairy free like myself to see what she thinks authentically I mean I'm always honest with my reviews as you guys know don't be asleep I feel like these are gonna sell out really fast like they don't have a protein bar at EHP but maybe now they do so I'm telling you if you're not vegan not plant-based not dairy-free go get some of this <laughs>